Hello friends welcome back here. Ryan Reynolds says he knows the actual reason to a plot point in the Deadpool and Wolverine, but the audience never understood why Thor was crying. Deadpool and Wolverine, which finally hits theaters after several years of development, introduces Ryan Reynolds' Wade Wilson into the MCU canon. Deadpool and Wolverine is quickly turning into one of Marvel Studios' best-received MCU movies and a box office hit. Repurposed archival footage of Chris Hemsworth as Thor from the Phase 2 movie Thor The Dark World was one of the major appearances in Deadpool and Wolverine. Following the film's premiere, one of the main questions was why Thor was crying over Deadpool. To that Reynolds responded on X, saying he knows why. In Deadpool and Wolverine, the actor also provided a high-resolution rendition of Wade's brief moment with Thor, providing a clear glimpse of the Merc with a mouth who appeared to be slowly dying in the Asgardian's embrace. Given that Deadpool and Wolverine has just been in cinemas for a week, it is unclear if Reynolds would disclose the precise reason. So was Wade Wilson's death hinted by Deadpool and Wolverine in Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars? Wade's eventual demise may be hinting at a genuine plot point for the MCU, even if it was probably merely intended to be a lighthearted Marvel Easter egg in Deadpool and Wolverine. Deadpool may have recently entered the MCU, but that doesn't mean Reynolds' character is completely safe from dying in the future. In fact, Deadpool's talents save him from dying. According to Mr. Paradox's comment in Deadpool and Wolverine, Wade will eventually pass away, however it could happen sooner rather than later. It wouldn't be shocking if Deadpool and Wolverine's foreshadowing served to build up Wade's death as the plot point of Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars. There will undoubtedly be significant, major fatalities in the upcoming years as Marvel Studios moves into Phase 7, which is expected to culminate into a soft reset for the MCU. Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds both look to be returning in some form or another for Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars, so losing any of them would be devastating. But Reynolds doesn't have to end there because Deadpool and Wolverine established the possibility of Wade passing away at some point in the story. There's no reason Deadpool couldn't depend on the idea that superheroes frequently rise from the dead, as shown in several media adaptations and comic books. For the time being, Deadpool and Wolverine and its enigmatic Thor sequence are showing in cinemas. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.